Why, hello everybody. How are you all doing? Tonight is a uh, Tuesday night. It is around. I don't know what time it is. Like eight thirty, eight, eight. I don't know something. Um, I'm sitting here and I'm doing my homework. Homework, 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 homework. Eh, it's all right. But get it done. Get her done. Um, how are you all doing? I, today was a very stressful day for me, um, lots happened, but that is perfectly okay. Sorry, I'm trying to find my pen, I don't, here it is. I didn't want it getting lost, so then when I would like, stop making this vlog, because eventually I'm going to stop having to make this vlog so I can finish doing my homework. Um, but anyways, today was, that was very stressful. Um, lots of things happened today, and, um, lots of things good and not so good. Um, I would like to point out that it is nine days until I see Claire. I'm very excited. We're, we are both very excited. I know a lot of you are very excited. Oh, by the way, you like my hair? You liking it? You digging it? I didn't feel like doing it. You're gonna find a lot of vlogs. I'm just not gonna feel like doing my hair. Um, stuck. Um... But, um, so, along with today, it was a very, very stressful day, and, um, things happen in lunch, but that's, that's perfectly okay, um, and then, it started, it started getting better in English. I find in English class... I, I think, because we have class discussions, and today in English, we were talking about discrimination and hatred, and, um, like how, how especially us as Americans, and many people, well, everybody around the country, will, at one point of their life, or throughout their whole entire life, will discriminate somebody, and it's crazy to think about. And, um, you know, it is, it is crazy. And my teacher was making points where, you know, we just need to accept everybody for who they are because we are all human beings. We're all along for the journey, but we all have different journeys throughout life. We all take these different, different steps, these different paths, these you know, different ways of doing things because we are who we are. Nobody else is like us. We are one of a kind. And that's what makes us all unique. And why hate on somebody for them being unique? For them being, you know, who they are. And, um, you know, she was saying the the discrimination that goes on in school and not only my school but all the schools throughout the world the discrimination for whether you are handicapped whether you are uh, well depending on your sexuality depending on your hair color your eyes you know the clothes you wear your your appearance you know that kind of discrimination, people don't realize that sometimes what you think is a joke or whether you're using it as a joke or whether you are using it to actually put against somebody and hurt them, it can be very offensive and it can very, it, it puts a big effect on that person, whether they take it offensively or not and whether they say, um, don't worry, no offense, like, it's okay. You know, somewhere's in there, they're, they're like, wow, I wish, I wish that person didn't, didn't say that. Because it, it makes, it makes impact on us. And it makes us feel horrible as human beings. And, you know, how would you like it? She, my, my teacher used this re reference, and she went around the, around the class Saying this to everybody, how would you like it if I called you, um, 
I don't even know what she was calling us, but, like, she was using it as an example. And she was, like, she came to me and was, like, how would you like it if I called you this, this, and this? And I was, like, well, I wouldn't like that at all. And I would stick up for myself. And if I heard that coming out of anybody's mouth, like, I will stick up for them. Like, if I am there to witness something, I will stick up for the person that is being bullied. I will stick up for the person that is being discriminated because I am that type of person. I... I stick up for people. I help people. And I said that. And the whole class was, like, a little taken back. Like, wow. You know, maybe that is right. Because there has been many things said within my school. And many things said within that class. And I have said something because I have, I have seen it. I have witnessed people getting discriminated. And not only have I witnessed... Not only have I seen and not only have I helped, but I have been discriminated myself. So I know exactly how it feels. And not only have I been discriminated in person, I've been discriminated over the internet. I've been, you know, discriminated by people who I've known for years and years and years who said they're my best friends. And, you know, if you're once your best friends aren't there, let them go. They're not your true friends. You will find true friends, and I definitely, I definitely have found my true friends, and, um, basically what I'm trying to come across and say in this vlog is if you see somebody, whether you are in public, whether you are in New York City, or Miami, or Chicago, or LA, or England, or anywhere in the world, wherever you are, or whether you be in a doctor's office, whether whether you be in your own room or in school, anywhere, and you see somebody getting discriminated, getting hated on, getting hurtful things said to them, say something, stick up for them, help them. It will make a difference, and I promise you, it will. Whether you feel... Like, oh, well, if I stick up for that person, then I'm going to get crap for it. <laughs> Who cares? Who cares? Because at the end of the, end of the day, sorry, I cannot speak. At the end of the day, guarantee you'll have a brand new friend. I made one today. I made one today, and I'm very proud of that. And, you know... Why not stick up for people whether you get crap for it or not? Why not? Do it anyway because it makes you look like a better person. It makes you feel like a better person. And it makes... Not only does it make you look and feel... It definitely makes you feel like a better person. Most definitely. So, I want you all to make this a goal. Um... For the next week, or few weeks, or throughout your lifetime, if you see somebody getting discriminated, getting hurtful things said to them, getting bullied, stop it. Stick up for them and say something. Too many people around the world especially teenagers, are losing their lives because of bullies, because of discrimination. You can make a difference. You can make a difference in somebody's life just by saying, hey, leave them alone. Get in the bully's face. Get in their face and tell them to back down. And if they don't, don't just stop there. I know you might not want to go home and tell your parents because you might be tattletaling, but do it. It'll help. Go tell your principal. Go tell police. There's so many people out there to help. And so many people don't realize that. So go out there, everybody, and make a difference. Not only for me, not only for that person that you're helping, but for you. <laughs>